I'm still waiting to hear, and I'm sure they're out there. I just haven't seen, you know, real football people who agree with you and not with me as far as the amount of advantage it goes. It's minimal. Right. So, so and, and there's, there's rules in place. There's penalties in place for breaking those rules. And now there's, in terms of this rule in particular, there's some ambiguity as to yes. what, the, what the penalty is. But you could start, you know, minimal advantage. A, a, you know, where is the advantage? That's where I think you, you start to determine, you know, what is the issue and, and how will it be addressed? Right. Then what we need to talk about in terms of punishment is proportionality. The punishment should be proportional to what the advantage gained is. John, minimal advantage should that not be minimal punishment? Yeah. So that's what they have to figure out. But what level is it? Is it between is it level two or is it level three? Now the problem is, and I mentioned this yesterday, is let's say they determine it's a level two. Well, Harbaugh's already been suspended for it's well, it's going to be it was self imposed, but it's probably going to be a level two, correct? Uh, again, it's waiting to hear what those allegations okay, actually are. I don't know that they've oh, even been notified of those. Right, but it's not its not a level one. But when you combine maybe two level twos or even a level three and a level two, they might say, all right, that equals level one. I Because we don't know what the NCAA is going to do. We also live in a world where people are disproportionately uh, uh, punished all the time. Yes. I mean, people who did drugs 20 years ago, you know, that are borderline legal now, Right. And they're in jail for a lot longer than somebody killed somebody drinking and driving. You Correct. know, that's that's the world we live in. Right, right. But that doesn't that doesn't mean we shouldn't strive well, for that. We're gonna all of a sudden do the that. right thing because it's Michigan. This isn't the w- real world we live in. So let's the, strive the wolf, to be in that world. Greg, you're to say, living a lie. What happens? You're living a lie that the Wolf Pack is coming. You, if a Michigan fan can't see that the Wolf Pack's coming to take them down right now, you're living a lie. We can argue how much they should be punished for this or not, and, and, and what's right and wrong. We don't live in a right or wrong world. Michigan put a targets on it back, on its back. It rubbed the NCAA the wrong way. Harbaugh has ticked off a lot of people on his path, and he's paying karma's price right now whether you should or you shouldn't. Then this season is 2022 Kansas basketball when they had those level one allegations screaming down their neck, and you know what? They were wearing rings, and they still are. And Kansas basketball fans, they're taking it, and, and they like it. Bob Stoops brought that up. This is why maybe you don't self-impose anything on you, and you let it play out. Just like you would. I agree with that. In, in <laughs> that's why, Har- just like you pack, would that's why Harbaugh should have fought. The pack the- never came after Kansas that hard. The Wolf Pack is they're on alert right now. All these media outlets are gonna dig and dig and dig to find anything that they can put on top of this. This is how it works. This is a sensational story with. One of the best teams is going to be in a college football playoff. And my prediction is this thing is just about to blossom into something even bigger as we move into November with these big games going. And you know what? There's no sign stealing in the big games. If they win them all, they'll, they'll still win the national championship if they win them all. Yeah. And you know what? And it's like we said about, do you think Louisville fans really are that upset that their T-shirts are void or that the banner's not there? No. They thought, they, they consider themselves well, national champions. Who's, al- who's allegations against them were worse, Kansas or Louisville? I know. Look probably, at uh, probably, North Carolina with their academics oh, I know. For, for all this exactly. time. Look at the blue, the blue Bloods. I don't know if they can be taken down. Michigan's a blue blood in football. But you've well, got this dynamic with Harbaugh that I just think is a little bit different. 248-539-9797.